Hey, hi, hello, welcome back, or welcome to, I've been in a demo mood, so I've been scrolling through itch, finding a bunch that look cool and interesting, so we're going to check out one of them. Uh, this is called After Me. The main goal of the demo is to convey the atmosphere of the place, reveal part of the story, and introduce the player to the basic mechanics with which he will learn the story and solve puzzles in the main game. Read the writing on the wall using ultraviolet light, and even shoot zombies to survive. Explore the basement, listen to every rustle, find objects to get out of the basement, unlock your memories step by step. So, puzzles, zombies, guns... I'm down. So without further ado, welcome to After Me. Oh man, right into it we go. Right into it we go. I literally hit, oh shit. I literally double click the EXE and this is where we started. No menu screen or nothing. That's how you know it's gonna be good. I really like the, uh, the visuals here. Jesus. It's very, uh, God, there's so much sound. What does that light switch do? Just fucking teleport. Hold on. Alright, we've got a blinking light. A can. Or those pills. Oh, we drank them. Whatever it was, we drank, ate, consumed. That is one thin wall. Uh, why can't we go up? Oh. No, the ladder physics are a little weird. Random light switch. On. Turn the power on. There we have some lights on now. Progress. All right, I'm out. So it's an ultraviolet light, but all right, I'm out again. I'll see you later. Not sure what it means by that. I don't know if we have it on us or if we have to find it or what. We'll use this iron on whatever the fuck comes out. You know, I'm not. 
not sure what keeps banging though. It sounds like a bucket falling. But, like I'm not sure if there's a bucket somewhere, like if that means I have to find the bucket or what. I don't really think there's much else down here. There's this thing, but I'm not open it. Looks like a safe. sure what for but we're the shot right oh wait there's something in the door no there's not oh fuck that why are you laughing right, we're gonna turn the lights back on chilling. I feel better with the lights on. Can I like move the door? I don't think I can crouch. Thank you. Need that. I don't know how to use it. of some kind. Okay. Oh, fuck that. Oh, fuck. Uh, on second thought, I think I'll stay down here. On second thought, I think I'll go up. Cannot. Uh, we might be fucking cooked here, boys. Hey, uh. So, uh, how you doing? such a cheesy stir but it like got me oh is that me oh, what 
what the fuck? Did I die? Upstairs. May I go yet? Let me out of this prison. vibrating somewhere. really weird. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I can't aim. <coughs> uh, center of crosser is not center of crosser. I guess we just weren't uh, close enough. That does not have very good aim. So, all right, can we go up now? says gun. I have the gun. Okay. This is interesting. Oh, that's it. We did it. Let's fucking go. <laughs> All right. So that was the after me demo. Uh, it started off super strong. I was a big, big fan. Um, I think the problem was they tried to mesh too much stuff together into one, but I really enjoyed the first half of that. Uh, until we got the gun, after we got the gun, it turned a little cheesy, but otherwise I thought it was pretty solid. All right, so we're going to try something a little different here. We're going to go ahead and play another game in one video. Since that was short and I have another game that I found that wouldn't be quite long enough to make a full video out of, so... 
Let's do it. This game is called Dark Doll. Dark Doll is a short horror game with a VHS style where the player finds themselves in an abandoned house shrouded in mystery. What starts as a simple exploration quickly turns into a terrifying experience. So let's get into it. Welcome to Dark Doll. Alrighty. Uh, I dig the wallpaper. We can open a door. What are we on here? Whoa. We crouch very quickly. <laughs> very quickly with the crouching. That's a dope ass painting. There's a phone. Everything is locked. of books on the floor. There's a key. Turn off the radio. What if I want it on? So I talk to the demons. Hey there demons, it's me, ya boy. And that's a cool ass painting too. I'm assuming this is what the key was to then. Because I don't think we could open this before. Oh shit. There's another key. And a doll head. I feel like there's just going to be something that fucking pops out now. That's still locked. This room is very dark. We have a little... Turn off music. Nah, fuck that. I'm going to go the other way and break the door down. Oh, oh shit. I see you, but I don't see you, but I feel like I'm going to in a moment. Yep, here it goes. You look lovely today. Can, can I leave? Is that okay? Would you like me to leave? Also, we randomly got a flashlight now. Password J3510 1733LT. Do not remove. What if I want to remove? What would you like me to do now, Mr. Ghost? Can we leave? No. We need to find another key, probably, actually. cabinets or drawers. Oh, there's a crowbar. Wait, we need that. Now we can break these pieces down. Let's fucking go. Oh. Ah, uh, 
Um, my bad. Didn't mean to disturb anything here. You need to find a Ouija board. A Waluigi board, huh? Oh, we got a key. I'm going to assume it's over here. Nope. It's in the other room. The other locked room. That's a couple heads. Okay. Fair enough. Right back at you. <laughs> I think these codes were too long. 1733. Three. I don't know. I don't know if it's worth it to go look. 1733. Nope. We'll probably find it on the on the Luigi board. I would assume, right? Oh fuck, okay. <laughs> You motherfucker. I hate that so much. The shittiest scares give me. I fucking hate it. Play a Waluigi. Or. Do I just not have to move? That shit got me so fucking good too. It's probably been the uh, the most scared that I've gotten in a video. I, I mean, it didn't even scare me, but like, you know what I mean. Eight nine three four, I think. Eight three nine four. Fuck. Three nine four eight three nine four. The doll maker. All righty. Thank you for playing. Thank you for making. So we should be saying. Alrighty, so that was Dark Doll. A short little horror. Uh, it was fun. Fun, fun little horror. It fucking got me, and I hate that it got me. I think that's the most I've jumped at a jump scare on this channel. And in a long time. And it was to something so fucking stupid. But yeah, let me know. Uh, let me know what you guys think of the like two short horror games in one video, or three even maybe. Let me know. Let me know what you think because I'm curious and I'm open to explore like this style with especially like demos and super short games. If you have any like super short recommendations, let me know because my list does lack some of those. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like on it. And if you enjoy little old me or this style of content, please consider subscribing. I have a never ending backlog of horror games that you're gonna be able to view right here on this channel. And if you have any other suggestions, short form, long form, whatever, 
let me know down in the comments because I'm always open to expanding my never-ending list. But until next time, bye.